Hey, it's Tony Talking Car Biz. Check this one out. It's a Tacoma 2023 SR5 access cab, four wheel drive. This truck is really a nice level of equipment. No, it's not 40 grand, but it does hit all the sweet spots. Hey, in this video, I'm gonna cover the exterior on this particular one. And just like everything else, this one is sold, but I wanna catch a video of it before it goes out because they're hard to find on the lot. And hopefully you find this video helpful as you make your decision for the Tacoma. Let's get started. This is the Access Cab 4x4 V6 Automatic. Really a great level of equipment on this one. And it starts at 36,800 and a quarter. So this is going to be probably one of the lowest priced V6 Tacomas you can get but it really hits all the sweet spots. So up front, we've got a projector style headlight here, halogen turn signals, not a lot of LEDs going on up front on the access cab edition, but it is a nice lighting package. Does include the uh, fog lights, again, halogen fog lights. You can see halogen lights tend to have a little bit more of a yellow light to them versus the uh, LED lights. The grill is a matte black ABS plastic with silver surround. There's your Toyota badge with the dynamic radar cruise control behind there. Even though this is your access cab, it does have all the top of the line Toyota safety equipment, including dynamic radar cruise control, lane tracing assist, road sign detection, pre-collision, a lot of great safety features are gonna be standard on the Tacoma. Now the uh, nice thing about the access cab is it's a decent off-road vehicle. The front bumper cover here, this is not painted. It's an ABS plastic, so definitely scratch and dent resistant on there. The limited edition, that's actually painted, and I don't think that's a great idea for off-road driving. The access cab does have the lower uh, valance on the bottom there. And uh, that you definitely want to pull off if you're going to do any off-road driving. Just a quick, couple quick twists of a screwdriver should make that go away. And then you can put it back on. It'll give you a little bit extra clearance. And you won't have to worry about damaging uh, that piece of the vehicle. There is a skid plate under, underneath there. It's not the larger TRD Pro skid plate. But it does offer that extra protection. Interesting thing about this access cab though is the over fenders are painted on here to match the vehicle. Typically they're uh, ABS plastic, but the limited and your access cab here, SR5, this is going to have the painted over fenders. The wheel and the uh, tire setup, this is a great combination of on-road and off-road. Uh, tire. It's a Firestone tire, 245-75 series, so a nice wide sidewall. Great for off-road driving, also gives it a little bit smoother ride. And that's a 16-inch cast aluminum wheel. You can see it's painted gunmetal gray, silver uh, lug nuts on there. It does not come with locking lug nuts, that's something you can upgrade to. Uh, front disc brakes, anti-lock brakes, traction control, and you can see up underneath, here's your suspension. So we've got a coil over strut front suspension fully independent so again a pretty nice smooth ride and for 2023 Toyota did raise the vehicle front and rear by an additional half an inch so it does have more ground clearance than it did on the 2022 edition of course the access cab is a four four doors uh, but the back doors are kind of those what used to be called suicide doors. Hopefully that doesn't trigger anybody, but you can see it opens up more like a clamshell. So a little bit different than you'd get with your typical uh, four-door pickup truck. And it really just does have a jump seat in the back. There are two seat belts back there, so room for a total of four people. Later, or in the next video, I'll probably jump inside. I wanna show you this really cool red and black interior. But that's how your doors open up on your access cab. Notice the door handles are painted colored to match. We do have keyless entry, painted to match outside mirrors, no turn signals in the mirrors, like you see on some of the upscale uh, Tacomas. Chrome badging here on the uh, driver's door as well as the front passenger door. Notice we do have our gas door here, chrome SR5 badge, and then privacy glass 
here on the back windows and the rear window with the sliding rear window. Shark fin antenna is going to be up top. There's your third brake light. And then all Tacomas now have a composite bed. And so the advantage to that is it's lighter weight. Notice we've got over the lip protection here. And then we do have a built in bed liner. So it may not be necessary to add a bed liner. Although I believe there's a uh, possibility to do aftermarket if you want to add a spray in uh, bed liner. Now as we come around to the back of the uh, Tacoma, chrome badging here for 4x4, chrome for V6. Again, this is your 3.5 V6. We've got Toyota stamped into the door handle. This is a locking tailgate, which comes in really handy if you put the Tacoma hard tonneau cover on there. I did a video on that the other day on the tonneau cover, $650 when it ordered from the factory. Here's your backup camera. Your tailgate, that's locked up so I can't open it. Your tailgate is a slow release tailgate and then it does have Tacoma stamped right into the back of it. Don't know if you can see in the video, here's something you probably don't wouldn't expect to see. I just ran it through the car wash. Those are actually bug splats. How do you get bug splats on the back of your truck? Well, it was brought up here on a car carrier and it was facing backwards. That's how that happens. A little piece of trivia. Chrome end caps on the bumpers. So that tells you there's no sonar radar or sonar parking on here. Otherwise they'd be painted colored to match. It does have a slip resistant step bumper. There's your bumper lights. And then here's your trailer towing setup. Four pin, seven pin ready to go up to 6,500 pounds. There's your trailer towing hitch. And then down underneath here, we do have, hopefully I can get down under there, there we go. So there's your temporary spare tire. That's a full size temporary spare tire, but it's not a cast aluminum setup like you see on the ground. Um, but it, you definitely wanna have that for towing. Here's a look at your rear suspension. You can see the Tacoma does have the leaf springs with the shock absorbers and a solid rear axle. I think that's gonna change quite a bit when we move to the 2024, but a very solid, very tried and true suspension setup with the leaf spring and the shocks on the back. Exhaust is coming out, single exhaust here on the uh, passenger side. This is a good looking truck. So this is uh, black and then the interior is black and red. So be sure and catch the next video because I want to dive inside and show you that really cool red trim on the inside. Here's another look at your uh, front suspension. There's the skid plate you can see down underneath there. So it is a steel skid plate. Does offer some protection. Not nearly as much as the TRD skid plate but uh, probably it'll be just fine for the average off-roader. Let's go ahead and pop the hood and take a look at the engine. Tacoma Access Cab is available with two separate engines. There's a 2.7 liter uh, four-cylinder engine, and then this one is the uh, 3.5 liter V6. So it's a 24 valve V6 engine connected to a six-speed automatic transmission. Produces 278 horsepower, uh, 270 foot-pounds of torque, and has uh, towing capabilities up to 6,800 pounds. Come standard uh, pre-wired for trailer towing, transmission cooler, uh, limited, sif limited slip differential, and uh, four-wheel drive as well. The uh, engine and the transmission combined for a 20 miles per gallon combined city highway fuel economy. And then the engine, the transmission, the powertrain warranty is going to be five years, 60,000 miles, no deductible. And then, of course, you also get Toyota Care. Toyota Care covers basic maintenance, so your oil changes, your fluid top-offs, your tire rotations. <clears throat> and then they also cover roadside assistance for two years or 25,000 miles, whichever comes first. So that's all included in the base price. So a real great warranty package on a really terrific vehicle. So that's a uh, quick look at the exterior of this Access Cab Tacoma. It really is a sweet vehicle. In fact, for 2023, it's a Kelly Blue Book Best Buy. Has, for, has been for many years. Just a super high quality uh, truck and a great value. Hey, if you like the video, go ahead and hit that thumbs up. 
If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, let me know in the comments. I'll do my best to answer them. This is Tony Talking Carbiz. Thanks for watching.